Well, I wonder how they make the bulk of that money. It's probably from um, buying multiple bikes. Because if they're buying in bulk, if they're buying multiple bikes, they have to be like a batch discount. That's yes. probably where so, they make their money, maybe. For used bikes, sure. Um, absolutely. Um, for new bikes, actually, um, do you know what floor plan financing is? Mm-mm. You never heard of it? So let's go. Let's go cover yeah, it. Yeah. So the way dealerships for bikes and cars actually operate is that the they they're the it's called they're they're floor planned. So if my memory is correct, um from my days of sales in Porsche, the dealership actually doesn't own the cars that are sitting on their lot. The oh, I know them. where you're going. I know where and, you're and going. So, and same with bikes. So you, you pay the bank interest for the bikes that are like if there is a if there are if there if there are ten bikes on your showroom, you have to pay interest every month on those bikes that are in there. Dude, go into detail. Um, this is a gem for you guys that are watching. This is good because I've read about this. I think I read about it not motorcycle base but car base. Mm -hmm. They would have. This is why they they do like the um, last year model. They have to get rid of it because that's accumulating yeah, interest. Because if it's just sitting on their lot, they can't yeah. get rid of it. They have to pay for it. That's mm -hmm. why, like especially like your. Now, like Porsche and uh, like cars where you, it's common to build them. They don't push it as much, but the philosophy is still there. Like they don't want to, if the car is sitting on their lot or if a bike is sitting in the showroom, they have to pay the bank interest for that car or mm -hmm. for that engine with wheels. Um, so they're always going to try to get ones that are off of the sh of what's in front of them because it's cost it's sitting there cost them money. Mm -hmm. So and yet they and again they and it's costing them money and they. They, so they owe the bank money on the model, on the bike or the car, and they also owe the manufacturer the destination of prep charge. So they have to figure out how to make up the cost somewhere, and unfortunately, it's business.